So when you think about more electric, it's really taking some of those mechanical systems or hydraulic systems and moving them to an electronic space. The ability to be able to analyze information, move information quickly, put information on a communication bus. That comes with having the electronics actually there that allows us to be able to get information so that we can make adjustments very quickly as to what's going on with the components on the aircraft itself. So now as you have things that are more electric, they're talking to each other. We have a lot of those systems and so our ability to be able to allow them to communicate, bring that synergy together, gives us a true advantage for the aircraft itself. In order to be able to provide power to all of those different electronic components and systems that are actually out there, something has to fuel that. Something has to give it the energy to provide the power to be able to do that. That's what we do here in electric power systems. And so developing those generators, those power machines that allow that power to be produced is what we're working on today. When you think about this business unit and what we actually do, it's like years and years of legacy knowledge and, and learnings that have actually happened. And so now we've got a foundation that's strong that we're building on, which is an extreme competitive advantage, I think, to what we actually bring to the table. One of the greatest feelings is when you've actually sat down, you've done the analysis, you've drawn up all the paperwork, and then be able to go and actually produce that, test it, and get it out into the environment and see it actually basically change an industry and how things are actually going to be done in the future. That's what engineers love to do.